want to tell everybody in, in the world? What do you want to say? My dad is a shit. Dad is a shit. <laughs> excited today uh, Sunday I'm gonna be going to see Iceman spend time with his family kind of talk about a little bit uh, of his training you know share that with you he's been using anchors and contacts which I think is is something that's really great we'll incorporate that into the into the training stuff he uh, I haven't seen him for three or four years his training has certainly evolutionized over the last uh, last few years and I uh, this is one of the things I love about being able to uh, have all these trainers around the world to share with you guys you know the the different styles and behaviors because there isn't one way one better way or one best way to make money there isn't one uh, best way to trade right there's a million different way to trades with a million different indicators with a million different systems and at the end of the day uh, as long as we're all kind of successful together that obviously is, is the goal that we have at DTA so it's really great to be able to, to well first of all I'll show you that he exists um, Iceman I mean, you, most of you guys probably just heard him by name you guys haven't seen him at all so uh, it'll be great to actually share this experience with you guys uh, if you guys have seen um, there's a picture on the website of Iceman with a, with a little tiny baby on his lap a little mini ice man while he was trading and now he's he's a little bit older he's a lot bigger and so it's gonna be great to show you guys the difference and yeah so there other than that uh, on my way to Singapore as you guys know I'm celebrating my birthday month in uh, in Asia we're gonna start in uh, and I think I've already mentioned it to you uh, a few guys a few times but uh, we're gonna be going to Singapore we're gonna be going to Tokyo after that we'll be going to Osaka to see the to see the uh, cherry blossoms because they're blooming uh, hopefully we'll see my boy Gareth tourist the townie shout out to him and uh, after that we're going to Bali for two weeks never been to Indonesia it'll be great to actually explore a little bit more of Asia and then after that we're going to the Maldives which I'm really excited about I got the drone you know I got all the goodies here in the drone I just bought this bag uh, let me kind of show you guys here the, the the jump off if I can find the, the zipper for it so all set with the drone give you guys some awesome aerial views so um, yeah, we're gonna enjoy the day. Hope you like. Hope you guys like the new kind of vlogging videos. Share you a little, uh, a little insight into my life traveling around the world. Obviously, sometimes it's not as uh, awesome as I would like to pretend it is. Because obviously, uh, you know, I didn't sleep last night. I slept 16 hours this morning. And uh, so yeah, so we'll see you guys soon. We'll catch up when Ice Man arrives. Let me know if you guys have any questions. Ciao. What is that? Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh Love, man. You got the camera out already. Yeah. 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 yeah I know. I know. Is there a is there a technology store around here? Like buy a, a 360 camera? Near near your house? You can't get a, anything on Sunday, bud. All right. Sunday in Norway, everything's yeah, closed. That's what I figured. Maybe I'll get at the airport in London. Look at this guy's face. Need a 360 <laughs> camera. Hello. You have how many Yorkies do you have? Two. Oh, you have Yorkies? Yeah, they're smaller than her, than him, really? than her. Yeah, yeah. This is Iceman's calorie. The sardines in the back. <laughs> here, let me get the let me get the camera back here. Look, you're on TV. See? <laughs> what do you want to be when you grow up? What are you gonna be, Oliver? What do you want to be when you grow up, man? 
You gonna be like daddy or no? No. no. <laughs> Who's your best friend? Daddy. Yeah, that's right. Let me get this woman over here. She gone. Easy life, eh? Easy life. Back to the crazy man. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Look at that beard. Favorite game? Yeah. It was good. But How was your favorite game? No. What game do you like? Huh? What game do you like? Uh, I like all games. What game do you like? Uh, hide and seek. Hide and seek? You know you you know you and your dad play hide and hide and seek all the time, finding trades. Why do you play hide and seek? You know, eventually you learn how to play hide and seek in the stock market. Why do I have that? So I can I can, I can record every part of my life. But I don't like to see it. I can do it again. I want to tell everybody in, in the world. What do you want to say? My dad is a shit. Dad is a shit. Say my my daddy is the shiza. The way is the sun. <laughs> You're crazy, man. <laughs> wow. Well, you see? That's you. That's you. See how tiny you are? I'm gonna, I'm gonna come back in another five years and you'll be taller than I am. I think one of the reasons why you were so successful is because you already had the discipline and the work ethic for hockey and then you just translated that over. You know, you just have to sacrifice some things. You know, what for me it was... Um, maybe some time with the guys, but you know, to me, it's worth it to to have something to set you up for your future, like trading can. Like, I mean, if you become a good trader and you really put in the time, I mean, the possibilities are endless with not only the money but the freedom. I mean, you can do whatever you want. I can trade an hour a day and and travel around the world or spend time with my kids so that when I'm done playing hockey, this is why I started trading, so when I'm done playing hockey I can continue to live the same lifestyle where, you know, 
I'm home with my kids every day at noon and I'm sure a lot of people, if you don't have kids, that's okay. You know, a lot of you guys want to travel the world by yourself or with your girlfriend or your boyfriend or whoever you are. Alright guys, that was the experience with Iceman. Uh, he actually does exist. It's it's really great to see the 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 evolution of of you know what these traders do over the years. I think you guys will be fascinated with what he's doing now, trading with a bit more what he calls context. Uh, even using anchors as well, the highs and lows of the previous day. Um, you know, one of the things that I think is um, always very surprising and, and something that, that people always kind of say, you know, the haters out there, well, you know, why do you teach people how to trade and sell courses if you're doing so well, so well day trading? And this is precisely the reason, you know, at the end of the day, uh, day trading is a tough business. It's not easy to not only start, but to also make money consistently over time. So I think it's important to be able to realize that when you have this kind of master grind, mastermind group of traders like Iceman and Nikolai and all these guys, Jim, all these guys, it's, it's it allows you to continue to adapt to what the market is doing over time. So if we're not able to adapt, if we're not able to continue to change, then we're not going to do well. And, and that's why I think part of the reason that we have been so successful over the years because you know, I try to be honest with you guys where indicators don't matter. I try to be honest with you guys and tell you that, you know, what you have to do is understand the price action, understand what the market is doing. And then from there, that's when you can actually learn to be able to become consistent in the market and do it over years, right? Over, over time. So, um, you know, I, I had a great time with Iceman, his son. I'm sure you guys saw in some of the videos as well. I had a great time with him as well. So um, I hope you guys liked the video. We're here in London. I'll, I'll give you guys a little bit of a sneak peek where we're at right now. We're in the lounge here in Singapore Airlines. We're uh, we're traveling. Uh, we're we're traveling uh, about 13, 14 hours to Singapore now. Meeting up with Faye, beautiful, beautiful Faye, and uh, my girlfriend. For those of you guys that don't know, and then uh, and we're gonna have a month long uh, April. Uh, birthday celebration so it should be good we're going to Bali Indonesia Tokyo Indonesia Indonesia Tokyo and uh, and the Maldives hope you guys like it I'm gonna try to record as much as I can to kind of give you guys an insight of my life a little bit so uh, let me know if you guys have any questions and we'll talk soon